Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many Android developers encounter. Our viewer is looking for guidance on how to get the current exposure using the Camera 2 API, especially after transitioning from the older Camera API. Let's dive into the details. All right, guys, we're back with another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find your solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To get the current exposure using the Camera 2 API in Android, we first need to understand how to access the camera characteristics. Next, we will retrieve the exposure compensation range from the camera characteristics. This will help us understand the limits of exposure adjustment. Now let's get the current exposure compensation value. This value indicates how much the exposure is adjusted from the default. Finally, to set a new exposure compensation value, we will create a capture request and apply the new value before capturing an image. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To get the current exposure using the Camera 2 API in Android, first, ensure you call Set Repeating Request on your capture session. Next, a capture result instance will be passed to your capture callback. Finally, you can retrieve the exposure time in nanoseconds from the capture result using the key sensor exposure time. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To get the current exposure for the Camera 2 API in Android, you can access the camera characteristics. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To get the current exposure using the Camera 2 API in Android, first, you need to access the Camera Manager and retrieve the camera IDs. Next, obtain the camera characteristics for the first camera. This will help you understand the exposure compensation range. You can then set the control mode to auto and enable auto exposure mode. Check the minimum and maximum exposure values. Finally, calculate the new exposure value based on the adjustment provided and set it in the request builder. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To get the current exposure for the Camera 2 API in Android, you can retrieve the exposure time range from the camera characteristics.
Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To get the current exposure using the Camera 2 API in Android, start by defining the Camera Manager. Next, retrieve camera characteristics by iterating through the camera IDs. You can access the camera mode and stream configuration from the characteristics. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one.